Hello friends! I'm so glad you're here so we can learn more about art together. We know that art pieces are made up of elements like color, texture, shape, and line. All the picture books we have read have art that is made up of these elements. Today we're reading a book called Market Day by Lois Ellert. Let's see if you can find examples of color, texture, shape, and line in this book. Hey look! On the cover of this book, if you look really closely, you can see that these zigzag stripes are made of thread. What a cool use of texture! This book also utilizes the technique collage by layering lots of different items and pictures to make the art on each and every page. Red Rooster Crows. It's early morn. Get out of bed. The chickens need corn. Pull up some carrots. Shake off the dirt. Pack the tomatoes. Tuck in your shirt. Do you see examples of lines used on this page? You're right. Look, we see white lines, orange lines. Lots of lines make up the pictures in this book. Feed the red rooster, turkey, and goose. Lock the gate tight so they won't get loose. Load up the truck. We're ready to go. Past the fields where the vegetables grow. What colors do you see on this page? I see red, blue, purple, turquoise, green, yellow, white, and black. Past the birds that perch in the trees. Past the snakes that sun in the breeze. Past fish and frogs that swim near the bridge. And past the sheep that graze on the ridge. We're all going to market. It's in the town square. To buy and to sell, that's why we go there. Here is the market where we work and play. Till the sun goes down at the end of the day. Then we load up, chug over the ridge. Go down the road, drive over the bridge. Past the trees, wheels turning fast. Past the fields. We're home at last. Let's eat. The end. This page shows us where all of the cool art comes from, from all over the world, that was used to make the pictures in this book. I see art from Guatemala, Mexico, the United States, Africa, India, Colombia, China, Panama, Bolivia, and Peru. How cool is that? Goodbye, friends.